Hello everybody and welcome to my 14th Visual Basic in Excel tutorial. Um, this tutorial is going to introduce while loops. Now the first thing I'm going to show you how to do with while loops is make a simple guess my number game. So I've already created the sub called guess my number and what it's going to do is going to get an input a the user to input a value between 1 and 100 and it's going to say whether or not the number they're trying to guess is higher or lower so first of all we need two variables we need the guess they're going to give to us and the answer um, they both need to be integers and then we want to give answer a value so I'm going to put it as 38 answer equals 38. Then we need to prompt the user to input a value for their guess. So we want input box and welcome to guess my number input a a number between 1 and 100 okay and we want to make that equal to their guess now this is where we're going to introduce the while loop say so we want to put do while and I'll explain what this means in a second and then we want to have a boolean statement so the same as in an if statement we need to have it checking whether or not this statement's true so we want to have uh, do while guess doesn't equal answer then we enter down and put loop here now what's, what this is going to do is do while is going to tell the computer to say whether this is true or false if this is true then it's going to carry on with this code if it's false then it's going to skip to the end of the loop and it's going to carry on afterwards so it's pretty much the same as an if statement except when it gets to loop if it's true the first time then it will go back up here again and then we'll reevaluate this expression. So it will keep going until this statement is false. So in this case, it will keep going until answer equals guess. So in here, we want to put what we want our program to do whilst guess doesn't equal answer. And we're going to have two different situations. We want it to either say higher or lower. So if we have if guess is greater than answer then we want message box lower else message box higher. And then if they've got it wrong, we want to ask them again to put in input another number. So delete that because we only want the welcome the first time. So this is going to first of all say input a number and then it's going to check whether or not their number equals the answer and if it doesn't then it's going to perform this code and it's going to say if guess is higher then it's going to say lower and if the guess it is lower then it's going to say it needs to be higher and then it's going to ask them for another number so they make another guess and then the loop is going to send it back up to here and now guess has a new value so it's going to reevaluate this expression with the value that's been put in here and if they're not the same then it'll say higher and lower and then it'll ask them for a number and number and then it'll keep on going until they get the correct number and then once this evaluates as false so 
guess does equal answer, then it will skip down here and we want it to say message box correct number well done okay so if we run this now play welcome to guess my number input a number between 1 and 100 so if I put in 10 okay higher so we know it needs to be higher than 10 let's try 90 okay lower okay let's try 50 lower 40 lower 30 higher 36 higher 38 correct number well done brilliant so it's taken a value for the guess it's working out whether or not guess doesn't equal answer and if that statement is true then it performs this and then it goes back up here again and checks with the new value of guess that we've got from here and it keeps going and running that loop until you, f you get the right answer and then it skips down to here and carries on the rest of your case this is really useful for quite a lot of different things and I'll show you in the next few tutorials some of the uses that we have in for while loops so thanks for listening uh, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I hope to catch you soon